Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economic events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody. Let's uh, take a look again on the gold market. So on weekly report we talked about the recent and current sentiment in the market and uh, it's changing gradually. So investors probably have some doubts on uh, Fed activity in terms of the policy tightening, announcement of the tapering. It might be postponed maybe or Fed will behave a bit more diverse than market expects previously. And although common opinion still stands the same, that somewhere in August, September, we should get the announcement of the tapering, investors now have some doubts on the perspective of the impact, maybe, of this policy on the markets. Uh, because, as we said, as in the weekly report on the Forex market, as in the gold market, if you'll take a look at the interest rates, just take a look what's going on here. It's 10-year yield. When you have the tapering announcement right around the corner, probably interest rates should behave differently. But you can see that it's dropping. Despite the recent strong statistics that we've got and other stuff, so you can see market now is coming lower in this 118 area. Of course, this looks and stands friendly to all dollar rivals because low interest rates pressing on the United States dollar, it means that the gold, your currency and other currencies We'll have some breathe, uh, uh, we'll have some room to breathe and uh, could keep going higher. But I'm not speaking about uh, some bullish reversal major trend or something of that sort, but uh, it means that here we should get, we, we could get some upper continuation. Maybe to the OP, as we said, 1872, but overall consensus currently on the market stands around 1840 area. And uh, we also have here the target, we already talked about this, this is COP is minimum target of this ABCD pattern, 1840. And take a look here, the daily overbought stands as well. So currently we are focused on this upside target. Uh, this is the destination point. Uh, at the same time, we agreed to keep an eye on the support area and possible bullish pattern that could become the background for starting our protection. Additionally, on the follow time from chart, we said that, well, maybe we could increase the target a bit not to the 1840, but maybe 1845, 1846, because market could form the butterfly here, and it has the 127 extension slightly higher than the 1840 COP target. So, uh, when everything stands clear about the targets, now let's keep watching what's going on currently in this area, because market stands at the 618 support, as we said, and uh, we agreed to take, take a look on the possible reversal patterns that might be formed here. Well, uh, the first bullish sign we already have, so you can see market here has formed bullish reversal swing because this upper swing stands greater than the previous swing down. This is great. And even after that, this market already has shown 618 pullback. Theoretically, we could treat it, well, some kind of the hand and shoulders has been formed here. It's not very accurate, but some shape exists here in the market. At the same time, uh, it's uh, not the perfect shape and we can't say definitely that uh, the pattern already stands in place. In general, overall market performance here stands, well, supportive to the cold market. It looks uh, more bullish rather than bearish because market stands at the major support, 1805. It also keeps, as we said, its natural support resistance area. As market stands above it, forming bullish reversal swing. And theoretically, if you do not want to wait for some more patterns or you worry that you could miss the opportunity to go along, well, theoretically, you could consider maybe taking the position, I don't know, but with the place down somewhere below these areas. For the patient traders, you could sit on the hands a bit more and wait for more clarity, maybe some different patterns might be formed. Because although overall performance looks great, not, not bad actually, it's difficult to say that we, we have some clear passion in place. So maybe something else will be formed here. Um, but market shows some 
a resistance to the downward action. It shows nice price action around the major support where we intend and in general watching for chance to go along. So if you do not want to catch some minor swings here and you are ready to go along in general on this market with a possible upper continuation, well, maybe that's the moment where you could make the decision. Others who are not sure yet, well, just keep an eye on the market, what will happen. Maybe some other patterns might be formed. Maybe market will form some kind of the Gartner's chipple to buy here, some extended pension, something, some else, some, something else will be formed. That's uh, what we have currently on the gold market.